I was trying to remind my husband not to say the, the term that we're not earning because it's not good. We are actually are earning but it's just that it doesn't go directly to me because we're reinvesting it back to the company. We buy equipment, we have new facilities, so that's why I don't have the net profit for me, it's reinvested here. Alright, so one of the reasons we live in BGC right now and we can't just go live in Katayil or Davao or in the province is because Threen's wonderful social enterprise. This gives us the opportunity where she can get to work, I can go support her, and I can still go back and forth. We can go all around. So BGC is the home base for now. Uh... What I want to do is give you guys a little bit of an update with what's happening with Reen's business and some of the things that she's got going on. But first, we're gonna load up the car and we're gonna drive to Marigondon. And along the way, I'm gonna show you quickly somewhere we like to stop and eat. Let's go. They can motors. <laughs> this is McKinley. Somebody's looking at me. Look at the counter flowing. Everybody counter flows, look at it. All right, 55 minutes later, we are at Ning Nangens, which I believe is a Kapampangan term. Gulai. So this place is really fun because you just pick a bunch of stuff and then they cook it for you. You can choose what way to cook it. They can grill it, they can make it soup, you can saute it. Uh, we usually get a sinigang salmon belly and then we're going to get a grilled tuna belly, no? Do you want gulai? Hmm? Do you want gulai? Yeah, let's get gulai. And they have like plates of gulai. She really wants to teach her own black like she loves them here. Nakano? No, because I'm not going to eat any love. Next time, next time. Well, you should start eating chicharapulak because it's that it's what your wife loves, what I love. You should. Tema, lingwahe, karasan, sexual, horror, or droga na hindi ako sa mga bata. Ah, you. She's making toyo because of the bulakwa. Toyo. I'm just looking at the book. No, no, you're upset that we're not having teacher on Bulakla. We're making an issue, love. We're making an issue. Making YouTube an drama. Issue YouTube, YouTube drama. drama. I no, don't just, be part of no we don't do the YouTube drama. Love, this is you. I am not Toyo. <laughs> so, we have a salmon sinigang and pinakpe. We're just waiting for our two grilled dishes. There's a pusit and a tuna belly. This place is great value. 1,187 pesos for everything you're going to see. We already started eating though. Um, and that's for two Cokes, zeros, and two waters. 
Therene's making herself sour and they always show Filipino teleseries here too. It's kind of like a natural setup even though it's fake bamboo. Uh, yeah, the vibe is good. So we'd like to stop here. This is in Kawit. It's just on the highway, maybe like two kilometers when you come off of Cabtex. Thank you. Nice. There it is. I'm not Toyo anymore. And if you didn't know, Toyo can be Sao Saoan or Toyo can also be when you're making like Awai or having an issue with the one you love. Oh, Toyo is experiment. Huh? It's what? Experiment, moodiness. Moodiness, yeah, so it could be like an issue, no? Yeah, but sometimes you just have Toyo, but you're not necessarily making Awai. It's just a mood. That's like it. you, what? not Toyo the they love. This my is supposed to be a hobby. My husband had Toyo. <laughs> we're done, we're done. We're gonna eat. Day. No Toyo. I was being I was just being hard working yeah. today. Okay, let's we'll see. He's becoming Filipino. He has Toyo. Gananumaga from Aragon Cavite. That is one of their many social barangay halls. That's Garita A. That's actually the barangay Threen lives in. And her. The barangay Garita has the best landscaping. <laughs> it does. It has good landscaping outside. Uh, we're heading to work. We got some coffee in town. Well, Threen's social enterprise. First thing we're going to see this morning what is something you do every single morning when you go to the office? We pray. And? We do our statement of declaration and we also exercise. What type of exercises? Japanese. A prayer, a statement of declaration and Japanese exercises. Good morning. That's a pretty legit declaration. That's a legit declaration. I like it. Now, may we invite our special guest for today to join us no. in our radio taste. <laughs> what? No, no, I'm gonna watch. I'm gonna watch. What is yes, this? Yes. I, gotta, I gotta watch, I gotta watch. What is, what is this? What is going on? <laughs> Does anybody actually? <laughs> Arm circles. Oh, sorry, sorry. We can't see you. One, one more sip of coffee, go. We'll wait for the bus to drive away. Ultimate goal in the future. This this store doesn't suit this social enterprise. In the future, hopefully, there'll be somewhere you can just drive in and it's open and it's beautiful and you can look at all the products. Yeah. That's something we're working towards and I think you're dreaming of. Yes. But it's still a ways away because the social enterprise, li uh, enterprise life continues. 
But how about you tell everybody in for 30 seconds what it's all about while I put your coffee down and have a sip. Okay, so Likang Maragondon is a native products enterprise. We have Habing Maragondon products, which is our local textile, and we have bamboo products. So in Likang Maragondon, we employ working students, we have senior citizens, all the parents, stay-at-home nanas, members of the LGBTQ community, and even PWDs. So at the back, you'll see so all sorts of products. We have corporate giveaways. We do long-term partnerships with universities for their graduation sashes or stoles. We also have Christmas products. Did, did you notice she could keep saying lots of stuff? Because they do a lot of stuff as a community here. There's 11 full-time staff. There's like 70 or 80 project-based people who work. Everything that comes in here goes to the community. Everything that comes out of here comes from the community. So what we're gonna do now is just for like one minute, show you some things you can do or get involved with, or if you know anybody who wants to get involved with it. Please, please refer us. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say, here's some education. <laughs> I thought you were drinking coffee. What's that? Is that the angels? Yeah, the angels. Okay, no, start start with the angels. Okay. Get the whole basket of angels. Show the basket. The basket of Go, angels. okay. Christmas is always better with angels. Like my wife, the beautiful angel she is. Go. Please what? be our angel, buy our products. Done. <laughs> what, what, what is that? What is no, that? No, no, no. Uh, so this angel, so you can hang it on your Christmas trees. This is made by a solo parent and she has a child who has special needs. So you want to support it also has our having maragundan fabric of course we also have our bamboo products woven by the barbecue stick community we have small versions bigger versions a smaller version of the bigger version <laughs> uh what's the hold up the kitchen towels where are those kitchen the christmasy towels ones here, the christmas yeah, right there sets. we have it here back door. cool Wallet. It's earrings. Ear. Oh, look at this. Okay, let's see. Yeah, little Christmas earrings. Oh, those are placemats. I'll take yeah. one out. Okay, nice. So cute. Then, of course, another placemat. Where's the earrings? I love the earrings. We have earrings. For me, the earrings are all. Earrings, earrings, earrings. Okay, but aside from lots of products, which you can just see, you can actually just see all their products on their Facebook page. I post them all the time. Uh, they've been doing a bunch of things like giveaways for companies. So for example, a company was like, hey, can you make bags where you include some sort of weave? Do you remember like a month or two ago when we went to Marikina? Well, they produced something. Yeah, we partnered with them and we created this camera bag. It's nice because you can like put a lot of things inside. It has a strap. So if you're a woman on the go, this is a perfect bag for you. I used this when we were in Saudi Arabia. Yeah, and that's that's literally the one that we made in Marikina, right? I can tell people that, no? Yes, yes. Yeah, we so, collaborated with another enterprise. So whenever they make things to including the weaving here, uh, three that goes around to other parts of the Philippines and different areas to try and collaborate. So everything literally is local. Um, we're trying to think. Uh, they make sashes for graduations. This is just like a really, really old little sample, but they've actually made a bunch of different schools, right? Yeah. Explain that. For high school, college, so if they need sashes or stoles, we can do it here and do long-term partnership. I think that's basically... Oh, you want to see something else? Yeah, please. This is so cute. This is our um, Braided Hope bracelet. <laughs> I'm gonna use this when one day I watch Taylor Swift. Show us one. Put it on. What are they? Are you upcycling again? Yeah, so some of these are from the scrap fabrics. Of course, some are from the fresh fabrics that we have. So try to mix it up. And it's made by the stay-at-home um, nanai. So they have their sewing machines at their houses and that's where they make it. So they're making bracelets here now? Yes. And your ultimate goal is to wear one at a... Taylor Swift concert. Taylor Swift concert. That's cool. Why? I'm telling them what is a story. Be honest. Good boss or angry bad boss? Angry bad boss. Which one? Angry bad boss or good boss? <laughs> be honest. Be honest. 
<laughs> no, they're not answering. They're not answering. <laughs> Bob, are you an angry bad boss? I'm a. Uh, I'm a kind bad. A kind bad boss? No, I'm. Nah, it's a joke. Three, three in our staff. Kind, but I push my staff. Three in our staff I'm get to perform huh? well. Say again. I'm, I'm kind, but I try to push my staff to be good at what they're doing. So that one day they can, you know, they can succeed even if they transfer to other companies. You know. Actually you, a lot of I, staff. I, I keep telling them the harder responsibilities you get, you become better. I agree. And and you should be for me, the reason why I got to the stage is because whenever things get crazy hard, I always try to appreciate that I'm always learning. And when people push me to be better, it's supposed to be something that's good because it makes me better. They want me to become better. Miss Universe. <laughs> I like it though. Uh, her and her staff have a lot of like emo moments all the time, and some of her staff over the years too have actually transferred to other jobs in different really companies, nice. and she's oh. always so supportive of that. And, and, I, and I just have to emphasize that most of my staff they didn't even graduate college, so I'm really teaching them. They don't know how to use the, some of them. They don't know how to use a computer. They don't know how to use like Mac OS, Canva, all those apps. But now they can do it. So uh, very proud of them. What are we gonna look at back here? <laughs> Aside from the sampai. <laughs> aside, aside for the sampai. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> when Threen first started doing the social enterprise, all your weaves actually came from outside the company, right? Yeah, from our school. But now they're looking at, too, training and making more weavers in the community so they're able to create more... Jobs. Well, not just jobs, too, also fabric to be able to use and create more products and supply more things, right? Yeah. So basically jobs. <laughs> yeah, jobs. So who is this? What's going on? Sheila. This, she's our new weaver. They just finished their training last month. Of course, she's being helped by Nane Belen. She's actually one of our sewers, but she's helping out in this. Because as you see, they have to insert 1,800 um, threads into the heddles. But it's not just that. After the heddles, they have to insert it on the reed, 1,800 again. Is this just to weave anything? Yeah, in anything. So, like when people say, can we have the orders tomorrow? Uh-uh, it's impossible because look at how tedious it is. That's why it's also a little even, expensive. Even, little even, a, even a hand towel would have to go through just yes. any of the weave. Any of the weave. And the cool thing is right now, they're actually trying to test different fabrics so this here is this is piña so we collaborated with another enterprise a new enterprise actually in alfonso cavite because they have a lot of piñas there so we're trying this is going to be our very first sample oh cool so that's what up to so as you can see too it really isn't just uh <laughs> I, I, I was gonna say this is your house. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, this isn't, you can see, like I said earlier this morning, how, you know, again, there's dreams to have a big, wonderful facility and like tourist oh, center. Wow. But this is the social entrepreneurial journey. Imagine almost five years in, but the, the first loom is in the back of Threen's family house here. And they're working together. You open up your house for the community, Diva. Yeah. Go, go, go! Show us your bike! Show us your bike! Show us your bike! Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. Go, Lisa! Go, 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 go,
I like this place. Do they have food as well? Nice, nice no? This is a beautiful little place. We come here sometimes, Mountain Brew. Super relaxing. Fresh air. That's Porto Azul, no? And look, you can even see, that's the to-go boat, I think. You can actually see all the way across the Bata and in the ferry. Look at that. That ferry must have come from Mindanao. Local coffee beans from Amadeo Cavite. They have omelets, they have salads, they have pan chocolate, and the best views. Good place to stop. Oh, they're almost legit. They put in like lots of tomatoes and onions. Look at that. Okay, love, where are we and what are you doing? We're in Tabi Hawaiian Bamboo Baby Spark Project. And as you see, these are our bamboo carols. It's made by Ate J. Over there. Rami. And as you see, we also have machines here. Um, this is a grant from the OSD t shirt. We actually collaborated with OSDM and PRDI, and we are developing bamboo woven panels for the housing industry. So it's a research and development project. We're now on the last phase, so after that, we can launch the product, so you guys want to order. <laughs> Bamboo panels? Like this, panels, no? Yeah. Cool. And it's one of a kind, because usually the amakans and the sawali that you buy here in the Philippines, it's all handmade, but of course, the slivers are not uniform size, so we try to fix it um, by having machines, but we still have our weavers who are doing the manual weaving and then we collaborated with some researchers slash scientists with FPRDI and the, they are the ones who are doing all the tests to prolong the life of the This is cool. Wow. So you guys created designs as well? Yes, it's new patterns actually. So it's part of our, our project objectives. We have to make sure that we make new um, designs. And are these ones actually, like is that design put together by hand though? Oh, so the machine is just to make the bamboo uniform? Yeah, yeah, just the strips. So we just make the strips using bamboo, but all the designs, even that one, it's all made by hand. Cool! So that was our final stop, just to show you a little bit more updated what Tareen works on all the time. This one here, the Kung Marigon that have in Kauai bamboo. Weaving Spark Project. And they're getting closer. I have to take this clip protecting my wife while crossing the street so people think, oh no, you gotta go to this side, love, this side. <laughs> I, was I was bashed last time for walking on the outside of the her in the road. I'm learning, guys, don't worry. I do my best, you just don't see it every time. <laughs> okay, time to get my scooter. Don't worry, love, you're safe, you're safe. Oh, I should have held the door open for you, now I'm gonna get bashed again. Life is tough when you're married and you have a YouTube okay. channel. A strong, a strong independent woman with a social enterprise.